Hey friends, Ash here with Chin Sense, back with my wife, Chelsea. And today she's gonna be smelling 10 huge fragrances from Mansara and putting them from worst to best or your least favorite to your most favorite. Yep. Do you think you can handle this enormous responsibility? You know, I feel a lot of weight on my shoulders all of a sudden. <laughs> but yes, I can handle it. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump into this and let's see what you like. And today's video is sponsored by FragranceUSA.com. Link in the description to their website. Some of these Manceras you can find there at a great price and you can use the code GENT15 to save yourself 15% off. I was thinking you might've remembered the code. <laughs> Well, I mean, sometimes they have an S in them, you know, gents or I don't know. Sorry, yeah. I messed that up for you. That's okay. So yeah, fragranceusa.com, great website. They've got niche fragrances on there for great prices, some designer fragrances on there as well. Like I said, Gent 15 will save you 15% off and they fast shipping. Okay, so where do you want to start? In the back and the front. I'll let you decide this time. We're gonna start in the front. It's easier for me. <laughs> <laughs> so here's the opening and I'm gonna spray the dry down. <laughs> and the way we're gonna do this is you're gonna say, for example, oh, this one's my favorite. It's in spot one. And then your second favorite would be in spot two and so on and so forth. And we're gonna move them around as we go. Right. Right. Well, hey, guess what? This one's in spot number one. <laughs> <laughs> that is <laughs> the fragrance <laughs> is lemon line. Well, I mean, it's definitely citrus through and through. The dry down is like a thousand percent citrus still. I like it. It's more rindy in the dry down, but it's still citrus. Like it's, it's through and through citrus for sure. You know what? What? I'm going to put that in spot number one. You already said that. Sorry, I'm just gonna say it again. Put that out there for everybody. Starting things off strong with the fragrance that begins at number one because there's no competition, Lemon Lime, which has a kind of a lemon head candy opening, like a, yeah, a sweet sure. lemony opening. And- All the way through really until the dry down. Right. And I think it's funny because it's Lemon Lime, and I bring this up all the time because you would think it would be Lemon Lime but it's not. Yeah. Next up, wild leather. You know, I mean, actually the dry down, I feel like it's just like leather through and through and leather can sometimes be a tough one for the females to swallow sometimes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> It can be a tough one for the females to swallow. <laughs> a tough pill for the females to swallow. Right. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think that went through either. Mm -mm. <laughs> um, anywho, but this one is nicely done is what I'm attempting to get at. It's, it's a decent leather. You know, Mansara can put out like occasionally some that I, I feel like are just a little much. Yeah, a little too funky. Yeah, but this one's good. You know, it's funny. Um, way back in the day, we'll say when you did not have as cultured of a nose as you do now, mm -hmm. you hated that fragrance. Oh, I'm sure I did. Yeah, you hated it. That's the what capital I'm saying. H. It's, it's a tough pill to swallow, but I mean, now, I mean, we're like, you know, a solid five years into this. The balls deep. Yeah. On, it, I yeah, mean, five years on YouTube. Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, it's um, it's grown on me. A lot of things actually have grown on me, a lot of things. But that's not to say that every woman out there is gonna feel that same way because a lot of them haven't been sniffing fragrances for five years. Right, so after all that, number one or number two? <laughs> um, I'm gonna say number two. Number two. It's a really nice leather book. Next up, we have black, Gold. Hmm, interesting. Interesting. I like Vanna White. Uh, I mean, this one's okay. That it's, doesn't sound like a rip roaring, uh, what would that be? I'm not. Oh, I forgot the word. Where you offer like support for something and you say, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm just not very excited about this. 
Yeah. Is that gonna kill you now? Cause you can't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because it's a super common word that I should know. And it just went out of my head. Yeah, that's right, that happens. It happens to me all the time. Uh, I'm gonna put that in third. I'm just not really excited about it. Not too pumped. Nah. Hindu Kush. Hindu Kush. Interesting. Uh, I like this one a lot. I think I'm gonna put that in second behind lemon lime. So that moves lime. Wild. Lime. Is that not what I said? You said lime. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> um, so that puts wild leather in third and black gold in fourth. Correct. Just helping you out there. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Sometimes I get a little scatterbrained. I might yeah. forget where everything is, even though I have it written down <laughs> right here. <laughs> so next up, we're going to go with Sicily. Not got too much Sicily left. Mm -mm, not too much. I mean, Sicily's a good one. I can see why there wouldn't be a ton of that left in there. It's definitely for sure like the most wearable one, I feel like. You think so? Of the one so far? Yeah, the one so far. The safest one? Yeah. Yeah, the safest one. Yeah, I'd say probably. Not that these are like super out there or anything. No, the ones that I've smelled so far are, I mean, really an average Joe could pull them off. It might maybe just a little bit out of their comfort zone, but still they could pull it off. Uh, gosh, this is difficult. This is more difficult, honestly, than I thought. Cause when I think of Mancera, I just think of sometimes it's, you know, kind of out there stuff. Um, do you? Yeah, I, I don't. Do. I think they're really, as far as new stuff goes, pretty easy, usually. Hmm. Um, gosh, I really don't know. I wish I could put, had like, had like a spot and a half. No, <laughs> can't do it. <sighs> you have to determine the ranking, the hierarchy. Um, I'm gonna put this in right behind the wild leather. So in fourth. Yeah. Okay. Next up, we've got a big hitter. It is red tobacco. That's tobacco that's red. Big brain. Thank you. And the bottle's red too. Ties it all together. It smells a little bit um red. Just a little bit like syrupy. It's like a oh. sweet. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's sweet. It's got a, a big old blast in the opening. A lot of spices and other things going on. Yeah, it's like a sweet tobacco. Yeah, I wouldn't argue that. It smells good. Again, nothing that somebody couldn't pull off, you know, too far out of their comfort zone. Again, it's really difficult. I'm gonna say, let's put this directly behind Wild Leather. Everything is getting, you're gonna put red tobacco behind wild leather? I really, that wild leather's really grown on me quite a bit. That should be like a pleasant surprise to you. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> so, behind wild leather. Mm -hmm. Hey, I get a chance at the end. Don't judge my choices. I'm judging not silently. <laughs> Next up, we have Aoud Lemon Mint with a nice gradient bottle. This is definitely a super easily wearable fragrance. So easy. I'm gonna put this right in front of Wild Leather. So in second. Yeah. That would move Hindu Kush down to third. Or do you no. mean between Hindu Kush? Right, and yes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Small brain. Okay, so third. Yeah, so that gets put into third, wild leather into fourth. Yeah, I, I got it. <laughs> Next up, Saharan wind. It's like you're in the desert and the wind is blowing and you're smelling it. Yeah, it smells nice and airy. You don't have to literally, it's got <laughs> wind, so it smells like air. I was just messing with you. It does smell very light though. I mean like a nice, fresh type of dry down. It also could be in part because this is the newer pressurized atomizer. Mm -hmm. So when you spray it, it does like a fine mist across the whole thing instead of just going blah, blah, and hitting you with like a little blast. <laughs> like a little Gatling gun yeah. of, of fragrance. And look, it's magnetized. Interesting. Yeah, cool. Uh, I like this one okay. I'm gonna put it, where's black gold at? Seven. Down at seven. I'm gonna put it at eight. So worse than black gold. Yeah. 
I like this okay, followed by, I hate it. Because <laughs> you realize eighth is last place. Yeah. So you say, I like this okay, put it in last place. Well, they're all nice. No, it's but okay. But somebody has to be in last. Somebody's got to lose. Yeah. Next up, the crush that is instantaneous. Ooh, this is an instantaneous crush. <laughs> Instant crush. Here you go. I like this a lot, though. Actually. Ooh, gosh. This one's my favorite so far. It's like my Mantera Parrot. I'm not trying to like make you, you know, like redo all the numbers, but I'm gonna put this in first. Okay. Cause this is pretty instantaneous of a crush. So terrible. You make me feel bad about myself. <laughs> oh my God. I need one more little, little thingy. You didn't count right. I just actually grabbed a handful. Sidge rat. Boise. Also, not a lot left in there, so clearly this is a more popular you one. You know what this is. I know. Try to pretend like you go, oh, I don't know that one. <laughs> yeah, this one's really good too. Uh, for now, until I can go back and smell everything, I'm gonna put this in second. Right in behind Instant Crush. All right, so. Um, but I'm gonna have to go back and smell them all, obviously. Yeah, you're gonna have to do that. Yeah. Okay. I got that written down. Smell away and finalize your results if you don't mind. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, I'm excited about this one. So we have come to the conclusion that everything stays the same. And by we, I mean you. <laughs> yep. So I think some takeaways here are that wild leather you don't hate as much as you used to. No, I actually like it quite a bit now. And Oud Lemon Mint, which used to be, I think, your favorite is not one of my favorites anymore. Yes, it has been supplanted a bit by some other releases. So we'll do the top three. The top three are... Instant Crush. Right, number one. Number two, Cidrat Boise. Number three, Lemon Line. Yep. Which you've liked Lemon Line for a long time. So yeah. not a surprise there. What is the biggest surprise for you? Uh, I mean, honestly, like the leathers and the tobaccos actually have grown on me quite a bit. So I know that what red tobacco is. Seven. I mean, I know it's down there, but honestly, it was still really good. And wild leather uh, has grown on me quite a bit. So I still think for me personally, out of all of these, that wild leather is the hardest to pull off probably for most people. But it's interesting that you like it a lot more now. I do. Yeah. So there we go, some smelling and rating of 10 different big Mancera releases. <laughs> Again, shout out to Fragrance USA, Gent 15, 15% off your whole order. Gent 15. All right, guys, thanks for hanging with us. Thanks for all your support. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you tomorrow with another fragrance video. See you guys later. Ooh.